time we're not on them last and guess where we are? We're in the Peak District for the first time this year. Happy New Year everyone. I've not been to the Peak District in absolutely, well it's been months and we are at Frogger Edge today. This is our last edge I think to complete. Deb wanted to come here because she loves an edge. So here we are, Frogger Edge. It's so fresh out here today. It's sunny. Deb's got the GoPro out, having a little go, trying to get some filler shots. Lucy. Yeah. Woohoo! Beautiful. Great day to start the new year. Do you know what? It's really cold, isn't it? I'm not complaining because it's nice cold. Crispy cold. Those yeah. views. The views, guys. Yeah, they can't see the view because. No. Yeah. <laughs> GoPro. Yeah. yeah. I like this camera because it's so you can... mini, mini nice camera, no effort. Just no press... effort. One button, off you go. Oh, it's fantastic. And we're at the ed You know what I like about this edge is we're at the top already. Okay, I'll click off now. <laughs> <laughs> Deb reckons I can climb this boulder and that's actually impossible. There's no chance of me climbing this. Not in a million years. It's like way taller than me. There's, there's no way I can get up there, Deb. No chance. Look how, look how tall it is, Deb. Yeah, it's pretty um, cold. So yeah, where have, where have I been for the past few months? Everyone is probably asking. Well, I've been kind of unmotivated. It's the winter, you know what it's like. And plus, I've now got Invisalign on. Had it on for 15 weeks now. Got another nine weeks left. Uh, yeah. <laughs> got a stubborn bottom tooth. I'm sure you probably can see it with the 4K camera. But yeah, it's really painful. So I'm getting that done. Got to wear it 22 hours a day. So it's kind of like off putting. Can't really go out to eat anywhere. The sun is in my face. Make sure to go and subscribe. All that malarkey. Oh, it's so great being back. Yeah. I hate you're all okay too. I'm on lots of hiking groups and it's nice to see that everyone's still going out. It's great. Keep it up. Enjoying the, the nature. I'm still not um, down with the hiking thing still, by the looks of it. It's fine! Bit of mud. Won't do anyone any harm, will it? Deb, you've also just vacuumed the car, haven't you? Car. You just fucked your car. Sorry, Deb. So where's the edge? I don't know, Deb. Where is the edge? Yeah, I mean, wh where is it? We have drove quite far to the top, Deb. Hmm. I don't know. So the first thing we've noticed about this edge, well, kind of edge, not at the edge yet, I don't think. It's very muddy. It's not too bad. It's not that bad, really. At least it's a little path and it's flat. Yes, it is. Whoa. I'm pretty sure that he's watching this video right now, but thank you so much to Addy for buying me a coffee about, I don't know when it was, a few months ago. Thank you so much. If anyone wants to go and buy me a nice coffee, the link's in the description. Yeah. Yeah, you're always trying to get people to buy your coffees, Lucy. <laughs> Sorry, Deb. You know, I'm not a cheap date, Deb. Not a you, cheap date. You would have a cup of tea, wouldn't you? Yeah, I don't even like coffee. Coffee's rank. No, don't say that because people won't buy your cup. They buy your cup of tea. Well, no, it's just it's just the site is called coffee. Coffee means tea. Coffee. It means a hot girl, drink, like doesn't it. it? It's a hot coffee means hot drink, doesn't it? Yeah. Deb's got a nice flask of a nice hot drink in it. What have you got, Deb, today? Oldie caramel latte. Wow.
great time flying the drone. It's very, very cold today. My hands are actually shivering. Might go a bit further down there and get out again. Love this drone, it's so cool. Come on, let's go. now approaching the edge <laughs> whoa yeah Sorry. beautiful view Seb absolutely magnificent wow we've been cooped up inside haven't we Over I'm not this tall really am I Deb no. one sec go on say it again we have talking of tall you know the measurement thing in our house yeah I think I've shrunk, <laughs> like half an inch. We've got a measurement wall right in our house. Everyone's on it that we've ever met. And Deb thinks she's shrunk. I don't think you have Deb, because I've not got taller than you. You're, you are taller than me. That's true. Got to get a drain out again, guys. This is just ugh, amazing. I mean, the messy hair, I mean, it's worth it, isn't it, really? <laughs> I will do. <laughs> I know you are, Dev. It's laughing at me. Wow. Oh! Yeah! <laughs> Not nice, is it? <laughs> yeah, Kerber's up there, isn't it? Yeah. So I've walked from Kerber all the way down here. Oh, so you have done it then? Yeah, I'm sure that recognise that. It does go Kerber, I think. So it goes frog up to Kerber? I'm not sure. No, someone tell us. Yeah, like, let's comment below. What are the order of edges? We should just look on We've map. done White Edge, we've done, Kerber. We've done Kerber, Baslow, Baslow, Stanage. We've done Stanage, uh, Bamford Edge. We need to look on that map. Yeah, we do. Yeah, amazing. It's amazing. Get the drone out. Get the drone out. That is just, wow. One second, guys.
I've come to the conclusion that I need to invest in some drone flying gloves because my hands are absolutely freezing. <laughs> They're like ice blocks. It's so cold, <laughs> but it's so amazing. It's so fresh, it's so misty. Oh, Frogger Edge, amazing place. I'm not sure why I left you so late to explore. Just wow. These tracks and this, um, on this edge, this is amazing. Look at this. It's really odd. If you enjoyed the drone shots, make sure to go and hit that subscribe button to see more on future vids. I really love flying the drone. Always a fun time, especially when you've got a nice view like what I have today. It's just amazing. Deb's just checking how many steps we've done today. What's the total, Deb? 3,725 so Wow. Amazing! It's less dangerous than it looks. It is quite scary though, Dev. Oh my God. It's great, I love it. God, amazing. Just what I needed, actually. As much as I do love watching Netflix, though, Deb, yeah. I do like being out here. We're on the way back now to the car. We are lightweights. We always have been lightweights, Deb. Nothing ever changes. So over the past few months, I've been writing some more songs. Go and check out the channel here. I released a song last year and that's done really, really well. So I've been writing some more songs out this year, which I'm really, really excited to release. So go and head over and subscribe or, or like if you're interested in my music. God, it's cold, it's cold, it's so cold. Deb. Did you watch that programme on Netflix? What is it? The 14 peaks yes. in like yes, seven months. Yes, I did. What are your thoughts on that? It looks horrific. Yeah. <laughs> that was really good. interesting, wasn't it? I loved it. Sorry, my nose dripping. Nose. Sorry. Yeah, it was amazing, actually. Very inspiring, but I couldn't do something like that. We're not experienced, Steph, and we're not really like, we just, we're trying to we'll dread that, aren't we? I would dread that. I like going <laughs> Deb would rather just get out of the car and be on the edge like Kerber and this one. Wouldn't you, Deb? Yeah. I mean, my worst nightmare would be climbing Everest. I've seen that film, Everest. I've, I've, in fact, I have to watch Everest. Why? Because I like, I like seeing them. I like the fact that I'm not there. <laughs> <laughs> what? Do you know what I mean? I mean, it's an amazing film. But Everest is like the, the penultimate mountain know, to climb. I've seen Everest, the film, the movie, about three or four times on, on Netflix. And I do enjoy the film and I enjoy watching, watching it. Watching it in your own living room. And I'm glad <laughs> I'm not there. I just think, I'm, God, praise be, I'm not there. Praise be. What's that a reference from? Handmaid's Tale. Yeah. <laughs> and you, I, I, I watch Handmaid's Tale thinking, thank God I'm not there. <laughs> Makes you appreciate your own life. Ha 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 ha!
<laughs> what was that? <laughs> wave your wave your right hand, Deb. Wave your right hand. In the shadow. Oh, I see. <laughs> so I'm, I'm curious as to why Frogger is called Frogger, and apparently I've just googled it. Obviously, Frogger is named after a chap called John Froggy Coats, who bought the land round here in 1290. John Froggy Coats, and he was from Froggy Coat. Um, what else? Yeah, um, and it remained in his family till 1752 when the senior member of the branch of the family died out. So that's interesting. So John Froggy Coates has many living descendants. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. There you go. Wow. John Froggy Coates. Good old John. So Frogger Edge is a grit stone escarpment in the dark peak of the, of the Peak District, okay? And Frogger Edge only applies to the northernmost section of the escarpment. The middle and southernmost sections are called Kerber Edge and Baslow Edge. Ah, and it's also accessible from Sheffield. Okay. Oh yeah, and Nottingham and everywhere. Yeah. So yeah, so they do link up. We, we, we asked that, didn't we, before? Yeah. They do link up. So that's right. really interesting. So much they love your facts. Really? Yeah, they, they love your facts. My long ass shadow walking along, thinking it owns the place. What you got there? Chocolate chip brioche rolls, vegan. Wow, vegan bun. Because wow. guess what month it is? It's Veganuary. Yeah. Woohoo. So I've come to realise, and I thought it was quite empty today because it's Tuesday, everyone's about to work, whatever. So it's quite busy here, really busy. Which is great, everyone's enjoying it. It's wonderful to see people out and about. Love it. If anyone hasn't been to Froggart, if you're looking for a nice edge walk, I totally, 100% recommend Froggart Edge. It's been really, really nice. That is a long walk. So before I forget, we went to Froggart Car Park and it took us right down the hill near the Checkers pub. But keep coming up, right to the top, and you'll hit a little side road thingy in jig on the side, a lay-by sort of thing. We park there and you follow the path and you get to Froggart Edge that way. So there's no steep, steep hills to climb. You're basically here. It's great. So yeah, little fact. However, I will put the postcode in the description box. So yeah, there you go. There's quite a lot of room at the top of the hill to park your car. Obviously, probably get hit earlier on busy days, but no, it goes quite far down. There we go. Nice little car park. Woohoo! So happy New Year, everyone! I'm glad to be back out in the peak. Just... So happy New Year, everyone! I'm so happy to be out. Oh my god! So happy New Year, everyone! I am absolutely so happy to be back out in the Peak District. What do you say? What? Happy. New... So happy New Year, everyone. <laughs> So happy new year everyone! I can't see it today, my voice sounds horrible, it's so cold. So happy new year everyone! I am absolutely so happy to be back out in the Peak District exploring some great places. But anyway, yeah, if you enjoyed this video, comment, like, share. Don't forget to go and hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!